Hello, hello, my karma babies. Hello, look where we're eating today. We're eating at Draco's. Draco's, the original Draco's. Um, the home of the original char charbroiled oysters. And let's open it and see how it comes. We had to uh, <clears throat> drive quite a distance, my daughter did, for us to bring them back so they're not like hot, hot right out of um, oysters. Okay, so. Got to get it so that you can see what it looks like here. Okay, and this is how it looks. Beautiful. They have their own paper here. Uh, char charbroiled with a two different cheese, I believe. And there's six on here. And then there's six more underneath. And I'm gonna put them out so that you guys can see them better, okay? But that's how they look in there. The wrapper, the box, when you open them up. So I'm gonna heat them up. I'm gonna put them on another dish and then we're gonna come back and eat, okay? Okay, be right back. Okay guys, so I did go and heat up my royal oysters. And let me show you, look at how beautiful that's broiled. Look at that, they are delicious. Mm, look at that, even the tips of the, the shell is broiled. They are called um, Tragos. And this location is here. Mm. That was so good. Mm. In Mississippi. Mm. They really, really are delicious. They give you some French bread with your meal, but I'm not quite sure how much I'm going to eat of that. Let's see. If I was there, I'd ask for some more of this juice and sauce. Mm. It's very garlicky. And very delicious. Guys, I also have some edinami. Mm. Because I love edinami. I sprinkle a little bit of this on it to give it a kick. And while I was at the restaurant, and what sent me to our Oriana restaurant, I think it's Japanese, was because I saw two nappy. On her last video, yeah, on her last video, and she was eating some dumplings. And that made me want some dumplings. So. I went and got some dumplings today. Now this is kind of mixed up because that's the way I like to eat sometimes. 
I got some um, lightly look fried kind of, and then I got some just steamed. I believe that's the fish sauce. It's not soy sauce. I think I a good, good look at my... <clears throat> Let's get a very good look at, at the uh, oysters. Yummy. Oops. I think that's a good thumbnail. So, let's, let me tell you, these are absolutely delicious. Mm. Mm. It's delicious. The charbroil on here. It tastes great just just with that. Nice dumpling. My daughter brought me back um, <clears throat> a menu from there. Put the juices off of that. And look at that. Comes just right out. I think they originated out of uh, New Orleans, so. And then they opened one here in Jackson. I'm not sure if there's any other places. I believe there are. And they're known for their for the broiled oysters. So good. And I got a dozen of them. Mm. Mm. Have to be a little careful because it is oyster and the shell. All of that is flavor. All of that. All of that. All of that is just flavor. Delicious. It's broiled. They do it over open flames. Hmm. 
I've had them before. My daughter's brought some home. I've never gone to the restaurant. She's always gone for us. So, <clears throat> I already knew how much I loved them, but I tell ya. So, I hear this is a great tourist des designation for New Orleans. A lot of people put that on their bucket list when they go to New Orleans. They want to visit Draco's and have the broiled horses although they have other delicious seafood. It is a seafood restaurant. Mm. So good. It has a breading and some type of breading and cheese over it. It makes it taste spectacular. If you're near the Jackson, Mississippi area, or New Orleans, or look in your, where you live, there might be one, a location in your area, a, <clears throat> a dozen broiled oysters are about $19, $20. Some of the spice. Clyde, it's okay. It's okay. This is all in the seasoning. You could literally make a meal out of this. Really.
-hmm. That's the charcoal. The flavors that are coming out of here, I cannot describe. Except to say that they are amazing. <clears throat> I am not being sponsored by these people or anything, but they've earned the reputation of having great charbroiled oysters. Well, they do say they're the original. Mm. And then you have another layer. <laughs> So guys, I'm going to eat a few more. See those? And I hope if you are new here that you subscribe. Um, I hope you like this video. I hope you share it. Thank you so much for coming by. Mm. So good. And as always, bye-bye and I'll see you in the next video.